Our topic for today is about good manners and right conduct. Because we have a controversy here in Philippines, what you call IPA. This is the article. They said, stop teaching girls how to dress. Teach people not to wait. All wearing of ladies a small dress. That's why some rapists have opportunity to do a crime. And other bloggers said, Stop teaching girls how to dress. Teach people not to rape. In my opinion, teaching people begin an early age like children. From grade 1 to grade 10. Just like the tree, it's too big already. You cannot mold it to go straight. Just like a tree, you cannot mold it to become straight if it is bent already. Try to mold it to become straight during early development. That's what we call good morals and right conduct. For those who committed the crime, because of that, we have a law. And speaking of good morals, during our school days, like high school, our teacher is all nun and sisters. Because it is a Catholic school. Being enrolled in a Catholic school or being a Catholic Being a Catholic or being enrolled in here You don't have to wear a small dress You are prohibited to wear a small dress in public places because our teacher is a nun and a sister. So, we are prohibited to wear a small dress like this. Respect woman. And during high school days, it is prohibited to holding hands between a woman and a man. Or no boyfriend or no girlfriend. We called it chastity. A meaning of chastity, it is a quality of someone who is pure and modest, faithful. If you don't like the rule, you will expel in the school. You will be kicked out in a Catholic school. If you are a Catholic or being a Christian, that's what our sisters or nun teach us all about. So the proper way to do is teach children on their early age from grade 1 to grade 10. Enroll them on Catholic school 
whose teachers are almost none or systems because the teaching is very much you know about good moral and right conduct for those children out there from grade 1 to grade 10 we have different types of good morals good moral character is an ideal state of a person's beliefs and values that is considered most beneficial to society and united states law good moral character can be assessed through the requirements of virtues acts or by principally evaluating negative conduct we have 10 moral values for children to live a great life respect Many parents make the mistake of teaching their children only about respect for others, but that is wrong. Family or family is an integral part of kids' lives. Adjusting and compromising, helping mentally, respect religion, justice, honesty, never hurt anyone. And about good manners and right conduct, there are ways to teach your child manners. Lead by example, say please when you ask your child to do something for you. Let them wait their turn. The root of good manners is to respect others. Show them how to accept compliments. Teach your child to accept compliments politely by saying thank you at the appropriate time. Good manners for kids to know. Put others first. Pull out phone protocol. Thank you note. Open the door for others. You thank you and you're welcome routinely and conversation. Shake hands and make eye contact. Teach them to offer to serve people to enter your home. And what you should wear on public. It depends, but here are some never to wear on public. Things things a first person should never wear out in public like capes pack your capes away unless it's Halloween diaper or crocs oh. the going out dress shirt motivational shirts skitters or shape ups Sweater best cargo shorts. And what to wear on public? It depends. What is your audience? 